Hey guys, happy October. So, um, I just wanted to show you guys real quick. Uh, this is going to be a very unusual kind of thing for me to say, but I'll say it anyway. Um, a few weeks ago, I was kind of browsing online like you sometimes do. And then I actually ended up coming across that, uh, that advertisement online for those, uh, internet free phones, those uh, gab phones, and I thought to myself, that's kind of interesting. I want to say very honestly, I don't have any kids. There's honestly no reason why I should have bought this thing, right? But guess what? I did anyway, you know? I know that lots of people, adults, give these phones to their kids. I know that gab was meant to be for kids. But I have to admit, the concept of an internet-free phone sounds great. And as an adult, as someone who has found myself being sucked into the online aspect that's, you know, found on smartphones, I don't really like that, honestly. To be honest with you, my, uh... My love-hate for smartphones has always been there, okay? When I actually got my first smartphone, I was kind of forced into it because I was using one of those, uh, it wasn't a flip phone. It was like the bottom part of the flip phone with the screen at the top of it, um, but it didn't flip up and down and stuff like that. My first cell, cell phone actually was a flip phone and then I finally found myself using one of those uh, other phones with the with the buttons at the bottom and, the, and a little screen at the top and one day it wouldn't work anymore and so I contacted the company um, a great company by the way I, uh, I have nothing negative to say about them they've been ultra helpful to me it's one of those pay-as-you-go phone companies and I ended up getting my first smartphone from them as a result, which I ended up using for a number of years before the battery uh, expanded <laughs> inside the phone. Oops. Then I had to finally replace that phone with the one I have right now, which I've been using for a couple years, two, three years, something like that. But, um... I guess one of the reasons why I felt the need to uh, unplug from the um, internet set part of the phone was basically when I saw my mother, my adult mother, who is 60-something years old, you know, every time we went to a restaurant to eat, she would play around on her phone at the restaurant. It's like, Ma, stop it. The food is coming. Put your phone away. Uh, so that's basically when I began to realize these phones are addictive. How do you stop? How do you stop addictive cell phone use? I've uh, been trying to find a solution that was suitable and I have to admit, when I saw that advertisement for the Gab wireless cell phone, I was actually impressed. A no internet cell phone? Sounds good to me. And even though I'm an adult, I'm 40 years old at this point, I want something that scaled back. I want something that has no addictive qualities whatsoever to it. The music that I listen to on this thing, it's good music, okay? I know that, you know, everyone would think, well, what's a 40-year-old doing with a phone that's made for kids? I'll tell you something. I love the concept. I love it. You know, I'm an adult who does not want to continue to be sucked into the world of online and everything that it pertains to. I just, I don't like it. I don't like it. And my goal with this phone, I set out on a journey, and I call it Finding Lucy. Who is Lucy? Where is she? 
And with this phone, is it possible to bring her back from internet addiction? I hope so. I hope so. So, basically, for the, uh, for the Gab Wireless Company, I want to say, you've done a really good job putting out a great phone. It's a good product, a very good product. I love the concept. Again, I'm 40 years old. And I purchased a phone that was intended for kids because I love the concept that much. If you really don't want to be sucked into the internet world and you want something that, you know, can free you from those addictions, try one of these. This is a good brand. As far as I can tell, I've had it for only a couple days so far and I really like it. The only things that are important to me are calling and texting and listening to music. And... This phone provides everything that I need and everything I don't need, it does not have. So I'm good. I just wanted to give a really quick testimony for any adult who sees these phones and wonders, they're good for kids. Are they good for adults? My answer is yes, they are. So try it for yourself if you don't believe me. If you really want to disconnect from the internet and all that it pertains to, try one of these. I definitely don't want to end up becoming like my mother, being in my 60s, scrolling through, th through Facebook when I'm at a restaurant with, you know, my relatives and friends. I want to be like that. I want to stop that and find myself again. And I think this is a great tool to do so. So I just wanted to uh, put that out there, leave an excellent testimony of what I think, and go from there. Thanks for listening. You guys have all been great. Have a great day.